Welcome to Mr. Gill's Academy of Math. Today we'll learn how to add decimal numbers. Students, they know how to add numbers, but when it gets to decimals, students get confused. So the simple rule to add is, to add decimal numbers or decimal under decimal, both in addition as well as in subtraction or decimal under decimal. For example, three decimal, four, eight, seven, and we are adding four decimal, five, four to it. So what we should do, we should decimal under decimal. And then you can write three decimal, four, eight, seven, four decimal, five, four. So what I did, I put decimal under decimal. I can do this question separately here. You don't have to draw the table. Three decimal, four, eight, seven, four decimal, five, four. See, I put decimal under decimal. So I can write decimal here. There's no number under seven. You can put zero or you can leave it as it is. It's understood if there's no number, it means zero. So let's add zero and seven is seven. Eight and four is 12, carry one. Five and four is nine plus one is 10, carry one. Three and four is seven. Seven and plus one is eight decimal zero two. So, let's see one more example. Uh, adding 456 decimal 57 and 2 decimal 54. So, I write here 4, 5, 6, then decimal 57. Second number is a smaller number. So, I do decimal under decimal. And before decimal, 2. And after decimal is 5, 4. So there's no number under 4 and 5. You think simply put 0, 0. Or you can leave as it is. 7 and 4 is 11. Carry 1. 5 and 5, 10 and 1. 11. Carry 1. Now decimal under decimal. 6 and 2, 8 and 1, 9. 5 and 0 is 5. 4 and 0 is 2. So this is the. So it's very simple, put decimal under decimal. And in case uh, there's no decimal given with any number, so number rule number two, if whole number is given, means there's no decimal given there. So what should we do? Then the simple rule is put the decimal under the last digit. For example, 35, there is no decimal in 35. So there is a decimal, but if there is no number after decimal, we don't put any decimal. So it's 35. So 35 can be written as 35 decimal zero. So now add 35 decimal zero, and the second number is Put decimal under the decimal three nine five and then decimal eight seven. There's no number here, put zero, no number here, put zero. Now add it. Zero and seven is seven, zero and eight is eight, decimal under decimal. Five and three is eight, nine and three is twelve, carry one, five and zero is five plus one. So that's the answer. Now, let's try some other questions also. I suggest to pause the video and do this question yourself. And then after that, after you're done, check your answer. 40 decimal 5, so I write 40 decimal 5, and you're adding 9 decimal 8. 5 and 8 is 13, carry 1, 9 and 0 is 9, plus 1 is 10, carry 1. I'm not putting any number this time. So 4 and there's no number, means 0. 4 and 0 is 4, plus 1, 5. And decimal under decimal. Second question is 8. There's no decimal given with 8, so I will write 8 decimal 0. And Second number is 56, 
decimal three nine. So there's no number here, there's no number here, put zero. Zero and nine is nine, zero and three is three, put decimal under decimal. Eight and six is 14, carry one, five plus zero is five plus one. Another question, 90 decimal zero one, I will write it here, 90 decimal zero one, and then four, I will write four decimal zero, so I have put zero here, put zero here, one and zero is one, zero and zero is zero, decimal under decimal, zero and four is four, nine plus zero is nine, so 94 decimal zero. See, it's very easy, it's simply, uh, it's uh, the, Question you were doing before in grade three, four to add uh, simple two digit or three digit or even bigger number. Only difference here is we are using decimal, so put decimal under decimal. Thank you for watching my video.